Hi, hello, how are you? Welcome or welcome back to the Curvy Chronicles. My name is Courtney. Uh, so glad you found your way to my little corner of the internet. Uh, friends, it's Meal Plan Monday and this one's a short one. this is all cattywampus and backwards because the original opening clip that I filmed I deleted by accident so then I went to Walmart did all my stuff all my shopping for the most part and then forgot to refilm but I have to go and pick up stuff from our car maintenance account because it is oil change weekend so I'm picking up oil filter for all three of our rigs this was a bad choice to do it all at once so Hmm. We'll see how this goes. And then Cody and Farmy, we need cat litter. So we are headed back to the store um, and then potentially going to stop at our local grocery store and pick up something for dinner tonight. I typically use their Sundays as like a eat what's left in the refrigerator kind of situation, but we are very much out of everything. So bye-bye. Basically this week we only have two dinners because we are headed out of town for my hometown county fair. The kids and I are leaving on Wednesday afternoon so I don't need Wednesday dinner and then Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We're at the fair. Cody will not be home until or not well won't come up till Friday so like he'll have to eat but there's like a lot of frozen stuff he can eat so I'm not worried about that. So anyway what I'm going to do is if you guys remember a couple weeks back I bought those country style pork ribs because they were on sale. So we're going to thaw out a set of those. I'm going to put them in the crock pot. We're going to do some mashed potatoes. The nice thing is, is we usually always have some leftovers. So my thought is, is the leftovers, we will then turn into like pulled pork sandwiches, which is easy peasy lemon squeezy. Um, so Monday night is going to be cut to shell pork ribs, Tuesday night pulled pork sandwiches, and then it is free game from there on out. Um, pretty easy and simple. So I, you guys right about now, will see all of the footage from Walmart. And then um, if I do go to my local grocery store, which I'm considering because they did have some fruits and veggies on sale, um, I will pop that in afterwards. But thus, I am gonna go to uh, Napa and Walmart to pick up oil change things. So, see you guys soon. Okay, friends, we made it to Walmart. Uh, realized I really only have two nights to plan for, so, uh, we are gonna do the country style pork ribs with mashed potatoes one night, and we'll either eat the leftovers for dinner or I'll make something with a pound of ground beef, like we could do tacos. We got we got things we can make. So basically what I'm shopping for today is Cody needs coffee. He does drink bougie kind of coffee, but so do I, so it's fair. Um, and then, let's see, so I he needs coffee, and then I just need to pick up like bananas. Um, strawberries blueberries like some fresh fruits for the kids not a whole lot and honestly it's gonna be a pretty small trip today um, I will make sure to uh, write everything out on my planner to show you guys because um, it's gonna be a light trip but it'll be fun so let's boogie Since I uh, forgot to close out the section at Walmart, which was <laughs> two days ago, uh, I'm gonna do it now. I spent about $40 at Walmart, so that leaves us about $35 left. Now, when I went shopping afterwards to go get a gift for the birthday party we went to yesterday, um, I had to use five of that. So I have roughly about $30. So I am in my local grocery store because they do have, um, oh, criminy blueberries on sale which I do want to grab some blueberries for the kids because they have been going through fruit like it's going out of style um and they also had avocados like jumbo avocados on sale so I wanted to get it too um we so that I could do avocado toast for breakfast this week and then I am gonna pick up something for dinner I'm trying to decide whether I do steaks because they do have petite sirloins on sale or pick up a pizza it's a tough choice. I think I'm gonna put this one out to the fam bam and then whatever I get, you're gonna see before I close this out. So, 
Let's go shopping at my local store. These are huge. Okay, friends, so I did pick up, so we're getting steaks for dinner um, instead of pizza, and actually steaks are cheaper than pizza, so that works out. Um, and then blueberries, avocados. I picked up some cream cheese because the other option I thought we have and like to leave for Cody is to do um, Seattle style street dogs, which if you've never done those, I feel like there's a bug in my car. And I can't tell if it's a fly. It's fine, it's fine, everything's fine. We're good, we're good. <clears throat> anyway, um, doing Seattle style street dogs because we really like those. Um, you do them like you do your bun and your hot dog. You put cream cheese and like grilled onions. And I like to top it with Chick-fil-A sauce, but technically it calls for mustard. I am not a yellow mustard fan. Blech. Anyway, so yeah, we have another option. And then uh, Pop-Tarts were still on sale, so I did pick up a box of strawberry Pop-Tarts because those are a household favorite and they were out the last time I came. So, I think we're golden. Um, total there was $25. So, we have $5 left over. Stayed in budget. Um, and that includes everything we bought at Walmart. So, you know good guys, doing pretty, pretty dang good. Did not wanna buy too much fresh stuff because of the fact we are heading out to my mom's and I don't want stuff to sit in the fridge. So like we have broccoli that we're gonna eat with the steaks tonight at home. Um, and then I've got potatoes in the pantry that need to be used and that's what we're gonna use with pork ribs. So, that is all she wrote. We have three dinners, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday that we are eating for and that's all she wrote, friends. Um, I'm going to quit rambling. Appreciate you hanging out with me. Sorry this was kind of kind of choppy and all over the place. But, you know, that's how we do around here. If I was actually on top of things, I truthfully think it might be chaos. So, anyway, I will chat with you later. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to keep hanging out, hit that subscribe button. And, friends, until next time, remember to spread kindness like glitter. Bye, y'all.